Hey, are y'all ready for an adventure? We're heading north. Stick around to see where we're going. If you're not a subscriber yet, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below and ring that bell icon so you'll be notified every time a new video comes out. Now here's something you don't see every day. If you find yourself between Wichita Falls and Vern on 287, check out the ladies in the green Cadillac. Honk and give them a wave. Here we are in Texas over here. And if you go right across this bridge, you're in Oklahoma. Texas and Oklahoma state line, the Red River. Welcome to Frederick, Oklahoma. Frederick is the county seat of Tillman County. In 2010, it had a population of 3,940 people. It is an agricultural-based community that primarily produces wheat, cotton, and cattle. Frederick is home of three dairies, a 1,400-acre industrial park, and Frederick Regional Airport. The airport as uh, restored World War II hangars, which housed the World War II Airborne Demonstration Team. Well, Frederick was uh, established in 1901. And the Frederick area was among the last of the Oklahoma Territory land to be opened to settlement. What is now Frederick used to be two towns, Gosnell and Hazel. Both towns were established in 1901 when the Kiowa, Comanche, and Apache Reservation was opened to settlement. In 1902, the towns combined in order to take advantage of the Blackwell Ended and Southern Railroad. The new town was named Frederick after the son of a railroad executive. Gos Gosnell received the depot and the residents of Hazel moved north to the new town of Frederick. Most of the business district was destroyed by fires in 1904 and 1905. The buildings had been made of wood and were quickly replaced with brick. In 1905, President Teddy Roosevelt visited Frederick to meet with Jack Ketchum Alive Abernathy, the famed bear-handed wolf hunter, and introduced the area to tourism and its recreational value. In 1907, the city of Frederick was incorporated. Frederick was named the seat of Tillman County, and Katy Railroad came to Frederick. By 1915, Frederick had 15 miles of sidewalks and crossings and 75 miles of wide graded rolled streets. Frederick was a major stop on the Wichita Falls and Northwestern Railway. One of Frank Kell and Joseph Kemp properties which operated from 1906 to 1903 from Wichita Falls to Foregun in the Oklahoma Panhandle. The line was sold to the Missouri-Kansas-Texas Railroad. The Frederick Army Airfield opened in 1941, training pilots to fly UC-78 light transport aircraft and B-25 bombers. In 1953, the base was turned over to the city of Frederick and is now the Frederick Municipal Airport and Industrial Park. Now yeah, let's walk around and get some pictures.
sure hope y'all enjoyed our little visit to the town square right here in Frederick, Oklahoma. There's a lot of other buildings that we wanted to check out. So we're going to have to come back and make another video. In the meantime, we're going to head out to the lake before it gets dark and check out the campgrounds and the lake itself. And we'll uh, have that video coming out real soon. So y'all make sure you hit that subscribe button, ring the bell icon so you'll be notified of any new videos when they get released. Y'all keep on keeping on and we will see y'all down the road. Bye y'all.